I know Hira. What does it mean? Be aware of the consequences of the hero! The monster! Leave Hira alone! I can't save you! I can't save you! Hi guys, and welcome to the episode of A Little Misfortune. <laughs> so, last episode was interesting. <laughs> Every episode is, is always interesting. Like, this game is always interesting. <laughs> but last episode, we went through a series of very particular questions with Mr. Voice, and I don't think Mr. Voice liked our um, responses, and it seems like he's starting to show a little bit more of his true colors. He's getting a little bit more aggressive and impatient with us. <laughs> but we are here in apparently Benjamin's home, and we're trying to find Benjamin. Mr. Naritor <laughs> wants us to find Benjamin, but most likely he's gonna probably try to kill him himself, or probably we need to steal something from Benjamin or just sabotage him in some way. I don't know. But our main goal here is to find Benjamin. So I'm really excited to see how we're gonna find him. <laughs> All right, Miss Fortune, let's go ahead and explore this place. Ooh, what is this? Is this Benjamin's? He got some sweet style. I like it. Oh, yes, his hat matches your hat. Very good style. Whoa, a video player. Fancy. Ooh, fancy. Ooh, can we play fancy? <laughs> what does that say in woods? TV? <laughs> Is that the monster? Damn it, I broke Benjamin's tape. I don't think you broke Benjamin's tape. I think that was Mr. Narrator sabotaging the tape, so I think Maybe I, I can fix it. I, I, you know what? Yeah, glitter. Happiness to the video player. Yeah, happiness to the video player. <laughs> and we put a little band-aid on it too. Oh, happiness to the video player. Yes. <laughs> oh my god. But I really think that was Mr. Narrator in the background. I'm very suspicious. I think Mr. Narrator is that monster being that's coming after us. Ah, uh, what a cozy couch. Is that Benjamin's diary? Read Benjamin's diary or respect Benjamin's privacy. Well, a lot of people in comments said, please, please, please read the diary. And I'm nosy as hell, so we're gonna read the diary. <laughs> yes. I'm just gonna have a little look inside. It's okay. Ooh, by Benjamin. Juhanilius Red Fox. By Benjamin Juhanilius Red Fox. I knew his name was Benjamin. Wait, are we sure this is Benjamin? I must make dench <laughs> dangerous mission. Mission must be done. Is what I trained to make. Nervous, but is okay. I has study and bigger confidence <laughs> oh that's so cute confidence i travel from center city to pandora when fog appears i pack things and food no information on how long stay i rent cabin until work done my task important boss told me many victims in town i need courage oh wait that's the little thingy from fan the little ghosty thingy Oh, is that the little scythe, like the 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 creature in Franbo, the one that came out of the moose? Is that him? Um, because I like I haven't been paying attention to the Easter eggs and I feel bad, <laughs> but I like that I'm finding some in this diary. After a long walk in fog, I arrived city called Opid. <laughs> I love the cross that words. Called Open Fields. Tiny town has good forest. Cabin very nice. Has TV. Kitchen. I sleep sofa. <laughs> oh, you're so cute. I de 
decorate cabin. Fish balls smell funny. Eat mushrooms in woods. I refresh after sleep. Try find parasite. Did not find it. Day one fail. Many victims. Gone missing in parasite game. I can't help. Feel sad. I send message to boss. Some victims not coming to center city. I see parasite. It scared me. Also, not eat more mushrooms. Stomach ache and much gas <laughs> is no good. Don't eat this mushroom again. Mushroom serious danger. Oh, <laughs> not feel good danger mushroom. I stay home. Cut wood and do tea and root soup. Good taste. I do dolls for victim and pictures if she sees them good. Parasite recognized. Morgo code P0101222. Well, I'm gonna write that shit down because you never know. All right, so I got the code written down. It likes to play. I has guide for steps. Courage tomorrow. Now rest until stomach good. Feeling no stomach ache. Aches only gas. <laughs> I go help missing victims in town. Morgo know I'm here. Morgo play old. Trick many times now, but it make mistake. One victim can hear its voice inside her head. I f***ing, I I knew it. I f***ing knew it. I f knew it. Okay, victim code, misfortune. It's nice code. Morgo can't have her say boss. She must be rescued. Rescued, but I follow steps. I saw Morgo take shape. Scary. What do you mean victim code misfortune? Boss send me message. Watch victim house. I sleep out. I sleep outside house. Hide in trash. I fail. Find parasites. It did not come today. Big trouble. Misfortune. Watch me. Strange. Why she see me? She big eyes. I run away. Felt warm in stomach. Maybe mushroom tickle again. <laughs> oh my god. Benjamin, you need to fix your diet. Oh my god. I see Morgo play old trick again. Victim don't realize all all is again. All is again. Must courage and stop parasite this time. I send many victims to so is Sinesserdy? Is that is that essentially heaven? I got level two protector. I confidence. Now I has primeve illumination cane. Oh, that's why he got the cane. He got upgraded. Ooh, uh, okay. I try primeve uh, illumination cane in woods. Fun. I feel courage. Practicing to help misfortune. I see she makes too much talk. I think she fun and strong. Oh, <laughs> that's cute. Morgo confused by charms of misfortune. I did video picking wood and parasite game and and parasite came, but I'm courage now. I scared only little. That's right, Benjamin getting courage. Oh, <laughs> I message boss. I'm doing it today. All steps followed. Prepared breakfast tea. Funny feeling with tea. Herbs from woods are fun. I'm courage and confident today. I ready. Oh, look at his little, little muscles. Ah, <laughs> that's so cute. Now, here's a question, though. Did Benjamin actually write this? Because we've seen the handwritings and stuff. Because um, everyone in the comments um, theorized that Mr. Narrator is actually the ones that are writing the notes because... Everything is very clean and legible. Anything that Benjamin wrote down has been super messy and mishmashy. So is it neat like this because Benjamin has time to write this down so he's not in a rush? Or is Mr. Narrator writing this to try to thwart us off on, you know, Benjamin? I don't know, but we'll see i'm gonna take this very lightly <laughs> but oh i love that i love that I'm, I'm happy i read the diary i love that Ooh. it looks like benjamin likes to educate himself i like that in a fox <laughs> the upside of being a spirit animal communication key to cooperation yes very true the fun stories of a boring man <laughs> When hatred wants to be loved, the meaning of love, 
uh, learning how to be gray, death after life. Interesting, interesting taste of, of books, Benjamin. <gasps> Is this the music that he was playing earlier? Ooh. Yes. I love how chill this song is. Like, I really, I need this soundtrack. <laughs> I love this. Ooh, uh, yes. Mmm, that tea smells like roses and lemon. I bet it's called Benjamin's Blend. Because I can almost smell his paws blending the ingredients. Maybe I should try it out. You know what? Might as well. I mean, we already snooped in his shit. Might as well try the tea too. I bet it tastes good. Mmm. It definitely tastes like his fluffy balls. Mmm. Delicious. Oh no. Ugh. I feel weird. What the f? Did we get high? <laughs> stop getting misfortune like high and stop making her get hallucinated because it goes off well and then she just ends on a super bad trip each and every single time <laughs> i didn't think that would get her like okay i didn't think that would happen but i okay <laughs> look at that benjamin looks so pretty in that hat <laughs> oh uh, wait if benjamin drinks his tea all the time is he like always kind of high <laughs> when we see him <laughs> I'm really sorry I broke your video player, but you stole the eternal happiness. It was promised to me if I beat the game. I really want it back. We can totally share it if you want. Are you afraid of the thunder, Benjamin? Don't worry, you can hold my hand if you want to. Oh, what are you? Benjamin? Is this a kiss? Is Wh this really happening? Wait, what? What is that? Your diary. I'm sorry if you're upset because I read it, but I was curious. Is it the monster in your diary you're afraid of? Oh. I think I saw him too. He's trying to tell us about Morgo. He's really trying to tell us about Morgo. Oh shit, so this is his diary for real, for real. You can't hide the children. Was that Mr. Narrator? Follow Benjamin. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Are you rescuing me, Benjamin? Like if I was a girl in trouble? Benjamin? Okay, yeah, let's go. Let's go. Go, 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 go. Yeah, yeah. If, if, if we stayed inside, we would have been f***ed. Oh my god. Benjamin, where do you go? What? Oh no, is this Benjamin? Wait, Benjamin? What happened to Benjamin? Wait, what happened to Benjamin? There's a hole behind the painting. Hello? Yeah, let's, let's go inside. I can't inside. reach it. 
I'm a little lady, you know. <laughs> you little lady, yeah. You, you little short lady. Yeah, let's get this. <laughs> oh, wait, wait. There was other stuff. Can I? Okay, no. Uh-huh. Such a clever little lady. Yes, you are. Such a clever little lady. You're so smart. There we go. Time to use my ninja skills. Oh, that's right. You were a very little ninja lady. I forgot. Oh. <laughs> Shh. What a bad crack. <laughs> Be quiet. This is a ninja mission. Benjamin, <gasps> are you here? <laughs> I'm crying. <laughs> Was it because we drank the tea? <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> oh, that was great. <laughs> that was great. Oh my god. Okay. I think it's because we drank the tea, Loki. <laughs> oh, that's funny. So it was Benjamin placing these. But Benjamin seems so nice. Maybe he put them for that monster. I was about to say, these just looks like traps to stop Morgo. Because that's what Mr. Naruto's real name is, Morgo, apparently. Hmm, kind of fish balls? This is like sushi balls. No, this is, no, nothing like sushi balls. Mm-mm. Hmm, a picture of a key. Interesting. It looks like I can open it though. My ninja senses are telling me to climb up on this chair. Hell yeah, let's go. Open the door. Hmm, a real ninja lady always touches everything. <laughs> a secret button. <laughs> Yes, we'll push the button. Of course. It's big, shiny, and red. Why wouldn't I want to push the button? <laughs> All right, then. I push the button. Wait. That was easy. Wait. All right. Time to find Benji. Oh. Oh, that was unfortunate. Uh, I are... hope things get better when I got the eternal happiness. Are you okay? Okay, Miss Fortune. Let's finish this. Get up, Miss Fortune. Wait! Miss Fortune, are you, you okay? You stronger than you think. Get the f up! You've been knocked down before. Uh, bitch, you've been knocked down way harder than this. Did you let that stop you? you? It didn't stop you from hitting the dog super hard and killing it. Get up, Miss Fortune. You can do it. Because. Because you're a little lady. You're a little ninja lady. Because. Because you're a little lady, bitch. You are the little lady, Miss Fortune. Hell yeah! <laughs> <laughs> Oh, why was that so, like, climatic for no reason? <laughs> I love that. Anything? No? Okay, let's go inside. That was a pretty hard fall, though. Like, I, I, I legit thought, like, that was gonna be, like, a redo. <laughs> she hit okay. her pretty hard. I'm out again. Anyone here? Bungie? Mr. Voice? I guess I'm alone. Yeah, so what I was trying to say earlier, like, is this the other world that we kept seeing snippets of? Is this, like, the in-between to Sinisterdy? Maybe? Oh, a baby deer. So sweet. Oh, mm, Dream come true. I'm petting the baby deer. <laughs> yeah, okay, yeah, okay, good, okay. I thought she was gonna break its head off, but we're good. <laughs> <laughs> That's Benjamin's bag. Is that Benjamin's bag? Yes. Benjamin? Are you around? He must be in trouble. I'm very disappointed in you, Miss Fortune. Ah, there you are. Hey, have you seen Benjamin? I think he's in trouble. 
Didn't you hear what I just said? I'm very disappointed in you. Mr. Voice, please stop playing games. You have lied to me all the time and that's very sucky. I knew I couldn't trust you. What are you talking about? I read what Benjamin wrote in his diary. All of it. You're the one taking the children. And I... I'm not the hero of this game, right? I guess the eternal happiness was all a lie. Oh, stop this nonsense. We have to keep playing my game. You can't make me. Yes, I can. Stop that. Then play with me. You need to find your eternal happiness. I'll give you a clue. It's at home, waiting for you. I'm sick of that eternal happiness. I don't want it anymore. You can't say that. That would break the rules. You heard me. I don't want the eternal happiness anymore. You heard I her. I won't tolerate this behavior. I'll be waiting for you at home. Now, tell me where Benjamin is. What do you do to him? Freaking monster. Oh, damn. Okay, the cat's out the box. <laughs> Miss Fortune is now self-aware. Yes, and I love how she just empowered. She's like, look, I'm a little lady, all right? You can fuck off, Mr. Voice. <laughs> but Miss, Miss Fortune, you kind of pissed him off. So, like, I'm afraid to continue on because of your ass. <laughs> Let's see what's inside. Maybe a clue where to find Benjamin. Because Mr. Naradu was not happy at all. UST. For students of the University of Senersidist Technology. Technology. Protect your course. Three-step guide. Three-step guide to exterminate parasitic beings from the beyond. Introduction. As the ultra-reality forms in hand with the concept of time, new realms outside the constituted FREE, -E, five realms of ex essential existence, have appeared. After the Ultra War, thousands of beings were discovered as byproducts of the war. They created for themselves a new realm. We refer to it as the beyond. The Beyond is, in simple terms, a place of extreme absurdity with no logical laws of physics. We can't allow such beings inside the FREE -E at the moment, since the foundation of our reality is based in the energetic and ethical values of the Ultra reality before the Ultra War. The Beyond is still a mis understood realm. We haven't yet found the pieces to connect with it in a logical manner. The few patterns we, we recognize are behaviors of some visitors, also known as parasites. They normally enter the third reality, aka Pandora, and seek fresh meat to lure into the beyond. And that's why we need the protectors. The protectors are the only ones with the capability of seeing the imbalance between realities and using the tools available inside the ultra reality. Protectors will help will help victims and guide them into senesity. The guidance provided in this book must be followed with great responsibility. Never skip a step. For each victim the protector returns to Sinestrity, the protector will be rewarded with new levels, tools, and more steps to follow. Step 1. The protector must locate the victims and the parasite. Protector's parasite case, P0101222 Morgo, evaluates if the victim is in need of assistance. If so, then proceed to step 2. Need of assistance checklist. One, the victim seems to have forgotten his or her identity. Wait, two, the victim is already dead but doesn't realize it. Three, the victim believes the illusions of the beyond are real. Four, the victim sympathizes with the parasite. Benjamin said he went to step two, right? Are we dead? Checklist of Parasite P0101222 Morgo. One deforms reality into absurdity. Two, Parasite seems friendly, yet it lures the victims to play dangerous games. Three, it shapeshifts into a human animal creature. Four, it quickly learns about the environment, language, and culture are not of an issue for this Parasite. Okay. Five, large flocks of black birds will appear near the parasite. These birds are the eyes of Morgo, giving him an overview of his playing ground. So you're saying you meet the f tell me all of the crows are 
okay so so morgo was controlling the crows and then the crows were just his eyes so he knew where the f we were at all times he knew where benjamin was as was at all times oh my god step two Use the surroundings to help the victim become aware of the parasite. The protector can, for example, write and paint simple messages in public spaces to increase awareness. It is strictly forbidden to interact directly with the victim. It could lead to irreversible trauma inside the victim's mind. If the parasite kills the victim, you will need to proceed to step three immediately. Step three, prepare for direct contact with, and then it gets ripped off. I'm sure Benjamin probably ripped it because he's like, I need this for my own safety <laughs> and to use it on on the fly like now at the end of the road you will realize you already signed the deal oh is it little baby benjamin is that benjamin also baby oh so cute oh that is so cute oh my god okay <laughs> that was adorable Wow, okay, so are we dead? Happiness to the bag. Yeah, it's all fixed now. So are we are we dead? Benjamin? All right, I guess I'll take the train back home. But... But if we... If we go back home, he's gonna kill us! You see, I should have stepped the other way. I should have stepped the other way. Then again, the game probably wouldn't have let me, but still. Aware, yeah, I know. Now when I look at this, I can see what Benjamin tried to warn me about. He knew all along. Such a foxy boy. I know, he was so nice. Oh boy. Miss Fortune, I'm so afraid for you right now. Okay, I'll wait here. Waiting, waiting for a little while. Ooh. Okay, I'm gonna talk to myself. Please don't. So, Miss Fortune, how have you been? Okay, I have this like weird day. I saw monsters, I saw dolls, I saw Benjamin, and then I went to the zoo and everything was everywhere. And then I realized. Mr. Voice had lied to me a lot. And he took Benjamin. And now I'm alone. I don't like being alone. Wow. Sounds like you had one hell of a day, Miss Fortune. The train is here. It was a nice chat, Miss Fortune. <laughs> Talk to you later. You go, girl. <laughs> you go, girl. Okay, H Hiro, like, if you're gonna keep popping up, pop up and help us. <laughs> okay, that would be uh, great. I wish I had my coloring book with me. Uh. Hello, Hiro. I didn't recognize you. Hm. Such a coincidence that you're on the same train as me. You know, I had a big fight with the silly voice in my head. But I don't think it's a voice anymore. I'm sure it's the monster. I saw it in a book at Benjamin's place. Really creepy. Have you ever heard voices in your head? I know Hira. What does it mean? Be aware of the consequences of a hero! The monster! Leave Hira alone! I can't save you! I can't save you! We can get it to the, the help him. Just help. Try help. Try help. Hira, hold my hand. Ah, oh, Hira. Gomen aside. 
<laughs> ごめんなさい<laughs> You see, that was a bad idea to start going misfortune. It's a bad idea to start going home. And then did, and then did you guys see the thing that was like behind her? And in, in, in the in the seat behind her? There was so much going on. I hope I get to see Hiro again. I wonder what that monster did to him. Ugh. Now I have to walk all the way back home alone. This is the last time I follow a voice in my head. If Benjamin was here, he would walk with me. Ugh. Okay, Mr. Voice, I know that you are very angry with us, right? Okay, I understand your frustrations that we didn't want to listen to you and that you got exposed and usually when people get exposed, they get very, you know, tight and pressed. I, I, I get it. I totally get it. But can you not, like, can you stop Benjamin messing with us? was warning me all the time, but I couldn't say it. I wanted that eternal happiness so bad. I'm a silly little lady. That's what I am. Oh. Oh, her, her, even her laughs are getting more and more, like, not cheerful. At least I had fun at Phantasmagoria. <laughs> I'm gonna tell mommy about it. Yeah, Phantasmagoria was actually pretty fun. <laughs> what happens if I kick all the kittens? Okay, I don't think anything happens if I kick the can- Oh, hey! What's up, kids? How's it going? Excuse me. I'm talking over here. Well, if that's how you treat the little ladies, then give yourself a fuck. Misfortune! Oh my god! Uh, they didn't do anything! Well, they, they ignored her, but still, misfortune! Okay, um, we're gonna look left and right, right? Remember, look left, right. Right, okay, yeah, let's just run. I don't know why I'm, I'm walking, let's run, okay. Uh, where's the car? Is daddy gone again? Oh shit, okay, there's, there, there's a ton of crows, he knows we're here. He, these are his eyes. <laughs> he knows we're here. Oh boy. <sighs> okay. <sighs> I'm so nervous. Okay. We got red lights. I like them. Mommy, I'm back. Hello? Mommy's not here. What's that sound? Benji? I don't think that's Benjamin. I don't think that's Benjamin. <laughs> Congratulations, you reached the end of my game. Leave me alone. I'm looking for Mommy and Benjamin. There's no eternal happiness for you. I don't even care anymore. Of course you care. You know your Mommy needs it. It's your responsibility. Yes, I guess you're right. Good, good. Ready for a new game? If I play along, Will you give me back Benjamin? I guess I will, but only if you truly commit to the game. Okay. Splendid. You will love my new game. What is wrong with Mr. Norwich's voice? I'm still on that This Wait. is Miss Fortune. Wait! She's a wonderful child from a not so wonderful family. A little sparkle for you, and a little sparkle for you. Wait! 
Wait a minute. Didn't I do this already? What? No, you're not doing this correctly. Then you say something about me dying today, which is totally not true, by the way. <clears throat> Wait, stop talking, please. Are we going to play another game, or is this like what? I don't understand. If you can reach the end of the game, I'll give you eternal happiness. And then you say deal, and I say yes. Stop ruining this! <laughs> eternal happiness? No deal! Wonderful, fantastic, ready to... Wait, what? No. No deal. No. No. Uh, how about this? What if the fox was waiting for you in the hallway? If the game is about Benjamin and you leaving me alone, I'll play along. Sure, sure. I promise you know the way. So, can I inspect under the bed? Because I missed that. <gasps> can I do the Mr. thing? Mr. Voice scares me again. I'm gonna run and hide in here. If Mr. Voice scares no! me again, okay. I'm gonna run and hide in here. I thought I could go in uh, uh, under the bed and inspect, but oh well. Because <laughs> everybody was telling me that I missed going under the bed, which is totally my bad, but it's okay. I will revisit it at, at another time. Huh, is this a new dance song? Why aren't you dancing? Oh. That's why you're not dancing, okay. I have a little hunch that Mr. Voice is the monster in my closet. But I, I, I don't think he's... I don't think he's a... I don't think he's a monster in your closet. Let's get out this song. Okay. I'm just gonna play this game one last time. Yeah, let's get out. The song is creeping me out. <laughs> Ah, I know not to run this time. No. No, okay. Oh no, not again. You promised he wouldn't be like last time. That was a beautiful example of cause and effect. Ma, you lied to me. I don't want to play this game anymore. Fine. Let me come up with a new game to play. New game. Knock knock. Who's there? No, I don't want to play with you anymore. Knock knock. Who's there? Just f say it, misfortune. You're scaring me. Stop it. Leave me alone. Knock knock. Knock knock. Knock knock. Knock knock. Can I interact with this door? No, okay. I'm going. I'm going. I'm going. What happened here? My secret spot. He won't find me in there. Oh my god. Open this door. Right now, Miss Fortune, we have a new game to play. No, I told you already. I don't want to play with you anymore. Ah, oh, Stumbly, teach me how to be brave. <gasps> so now we're playing hide and seek. I love that game. No, leave me alone. All right, just so you know, my game is the only thing keeping you alive. Is that one more of your lies? I will live forever with Benjamin, and there's nothing you can do about it. Will you please stop talking about that fox? He's been trying to take you away from me all the time, and his ugly paintings. Ugh. Oh no, you don't talk like that about my Benjamin. You know what? I'm done with you. I want you to leave. Right now. You don't have a clue about what's going on. This is not the last game you play with me, Miss Fortune. This is only the beginning. Oh, sh you 
silly little child. Another toy for my collection. You're mine to play with for eternity. I'm sick of you being a bully. You'll see, Benjamin will come back and save me. No, we made a deal. You crossed the path, and now you're mine. Why alone? Misfortune! <gasps> <laughs> How did you get here? There's nothing you can do. She belongs to me. And no, she doesn't. You get him, Benjamin. Let's go. That's right. Level two wizard right here. <laughs> no. No. That's right, Benjamin. That's right. I like how he stands here with his heroic pose, though. <laughs> That's right, Benjamin. Is everything back to normal now? Is everything back to normal now? Benjamin saved me. Benji, are you around? I guess I have to reveal this. I'll make some improvements. But first, I want to find Benjamin. All right, we'll find Benjamin, but thank you, Benjamin. <laughs> Benjamin, did you go outside? So that's what Mr. Narrator looked like. <laughs> very, very creepy. Very creepy. Hey, Morgo is coming. Open your eyes. He is the voice in your head driving you mad. Well, now I know what to call Mr. Voice. Interesting. Thank you, Benjamin. Morgo, nice. Benjamin, where are you? Okay, so this already happened. Uh, ugh. Talk about cause and effect. Really? Uh, uh. Benji? So you're just telling me if I actually patched it up in the beginning, I wouldn't have tripped at the very end. That is total bullshit. That's total bullshit. That is total BS. <laughs> Well, Mama's not here. We're by ourselves. Mommy? She probably went out grocery shopping or something. That's okay. Okay. Mommy, I'm right here. Mommy. I'm back. Mommy. Mommy, don't ignore me. Pay attention Are you angry to her? because I couldn't get the happiness for you? What's happening? Mommy? <laughs> oh, don't cry! This must be a bad dream. Wait! I 
I'm not crying, you're crying. <laughs> oh my god. Uh, give me a second. <laughs> oh my god, okay. I wasn't expecting all of this. Oh my. Misfortune. I can't even. I was gonna throw glitter. I was gonna say, you know what? Happiness to this life that we had. But. I can't throw the glitter. Oh, that's so sad. Now it makes sense why, like, those teenagers earlier were ignoring her and... Maybe because everyone is wearing masks? Is it because, like, because she's dead, she can't remember or see what people really look like, maybe? Thank you, wait. Are you taking me somewhere else? Because I have nothing against it, but I have to talk with my mommy first. Alright, mom. Mommy, I'm going to go somewhere else. With Bengi, okay? He's the fox that I like. I'm a little lady, you know? That's what I am. I guess I was your little misfortune for a while, but you need to find your own happiness now. I love you forever. Even through all of that, she still says I love you? Oh my god. Okay, let's just go. Let's uh, Benjamin, take us to the happy place, please. <sighs> Benjamin. Where, where are we going, Benjamin? Oh, okay, 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 he runs with me. Okay, cool. Oh, <gasps> oh I'm doggy! so happy to see you again. Wait for me, puppy. Okay, yeah, we really are dead. Holy sh we really are dead. Oh my god. Okay. Oh. Yeah, the dude. Yeah, that was the parasite thing from the moose. I was right. I'm so sorry, Beetle Pig. I am so sorry that I killed you. <laughs> oh, it's the the, the thingies. I, I I forgot their names. <laughs> but we gotta comb their hair so they can become free eventually. I swear to God, if you see Fran, I'm gonna lose my shit. Oh, are you serious? Oh, 
Oh, did I light it all up? <gasps> no, I'm missing one! Damn! I literally got everything but one, and it's the one thing that you guys pointed out. I think. I, I think. I think that's what that means. I think that's what that means. Because there's only one that's not shining. Damn. Okay, that's fine. All around, disasters seem to disappear. Deep inside the fog, you defeat him. Yes, we huh, did. I guess Mr. Voice game is over now. Benji? <gasps> Hi, Benjamin. Yeah, Mr. Voice's game is done. Benjamin, clap those cheeks. <laughs> Hi. Who are you? I'm a little lady. Miss Fortune. That's who I am. Lady Miss Fortune? Yes, you could say that. Good. Step inside. We were expecting you. Oh, you don't say. Don't mind if I do. <laughs> what is this place? Okay, we beat the game. Oh my god. <laughs> we beat the game! <laughs> wow. That was an experience, that's for sure. <laughs> I had loads of fun playing this. Like, just the whole feel of just you actually having to think about your choices and everything had a different outcome. So I'm sure like to other people that's played this game, you know, like they had a completely different playthrough than what I did. So that's a really, that that's just so exciting. <laughs> that's super exciting. And I like how my suspicions were kind of, were kind of on point because I was sus about Mr. Voice and I'm like, hmm. <laughs> Oh, I love that yikes forever. <laughs> but I, I had my suspicions that Mr. Voice was actually the monster and turned out to be true. So I'm just surprised which is the outcome. Now I wanna know what what's different with the ending if I got all of the little sparkly sparkles and stuff. <laughs> but definitely I am going to go ahead and revisit this game in a, a special episode to do um to get all the sparkles but also do different outcomes and uh, see what happens <laughs> all right but it looks like this is the end of this game i had loads of fun playing and i just can't wait to play just more games like little misfortune but definitely this game has become one of my favorite favorite games to play <laughs> um i fell in love with misfortune because you know she's a little lady <laughs> A little ninja lady to be precise <laughs> but i had tons of fun playing this and i hope you guys enjoyed this awesome adventure but unfortunately this adventure has to come to a close thank you thank you thank you so much so 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 much for joining me on this and i can't wait to start a whole new adventure with everybody <laughs> hope you have an awesome day and i will see you next time bye bye